than for him to allow him to max the ball key, which is what TA does. Yeah. Because because then he can just take tower right after. Further into like 25 minutes, 30 minutes team fight, where you have TB finally joining a team. Oh, nice. Nice. Uh, the faith beyond timber chain one, and they're playing aggressively. Chalice gets the oh. passive, and that's it. Easy kill on faith beyond, and continuing for Ch for Sin Q. Heroes like that, no, uh, maybe Ursa or Monkey King, you always want to get one point, the first point on timber chain yeah. or the rolling death. But faith beyond is being too Look aggressive. At, there. Look at this, how aggressive Sin Q can do anything. He actually dies without even tri or helping trigger the Jingo mastery. They would always uh, go. They'll always be on your on the same page as you, harassing the off lane, so you are not alone. You're not looking at that alone. Yeah, nice stun oh, on Faith Beyond. All right, can he get the final hit here? Chalice? No, nope, can't quite find Faith Beyond. Start salving in the trees. Sin Q gains the space. They go for Chalice. Chalice with a surprise fairy fight does not evade the timber chain, and he's gonna go down, unable to get the kills he was looking for. Faith Beyond still chasing after X Nova, but realizes this is not the kill to get. You come to the lane, and Chalice just goes, nope. Get out of my lane! Look at this, how oh. easy it is for Chalice to just bring down the Timber Saw. He's not even breaking a sweat. You have Tag Team activated on Sin Q and he's unable to trade lasses with this Monkey King. Juicy and tasty. Sin Q finds here. Ex Nova, there's a Tag Team ready. But, I mean, the TA can't really rotate. You're kind of a uh, mid lane. They're gonna fight for the rune. There we go. Finally, Ex Nova goes a bit too ham. In the end, Sin Q steals that rune and they should be able to get this kill as well. Ex Nova is gonna go down. Oh, somebody's look coming at this. with this. Yeah, with a haste. Thanks to Ball, Kinex Sin Q is being mowed down, tries to deliver the damage. Okay, Ancient Denial. No, oh, those Ancients are sleeping. Sin Q <laughs> cannot get them to react in time. And Somnus even finds nothing to say, takes away that uh, refraction easily. Oh, juicy. Nom, 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 nom. Uh, yeah, takes that stack, no problem. LGD is running all over the map, running through Ehome at this point. Innocence is forced to rotate. Somnus still strong. There's the cookie, find the Lash Rack, Ink Swell to Y. Oh, it's gonna get the stun up into the TA instead. Sin Q walks in, almost kills FY, does get the kill. Somnus though survives and manages to finish off this Tuscar. That's gonna be one for one here. No advantage either or. Uh, old 11 uh, sees Y here. He's like, all right. All right, no, no, I, I have all day. I, I can chase you, Grandma. No problem. She tries to jump. She lost her cookie, so she has no more mobility. Scatter Blast will do nothing. And she is gonna be torn to shreds. Easy for LGD. And now Summons joins in, this is what you were talking about, 5 man that they love so much. They control Faith oh. Beyond. Okay, that was not the best combo there. But it's okay, they should still be able to get the kill. Faith Beyond with a Timber Chain, tries to get away. Sin Q, sacrificing his life for this. He's gonna go down, but maybe he gives his Timber Saw enough space. Old Eleven is having none of this though. He knows where Faith Beyond is, he has a Spear of Mars ready. He misses it, Faith oh. Beyond! Nice little juke there. But will that be enough? I do not think so. The Split Earth is available, and they even snipe him, FY. Oh, actually, hold that thought because the user arena blood in the top lane, and poor Timber Saw is just stuck. Oh. How do you recover as a Timber Saw? What's your game plan here? I mean, I think you have to stop responding to every move that LGD is doing right now. Of course not. So you you have to you have to relocate your you have to locate your resources really good, and right now they are. Go on mid here. Okay. I think they can kill Somnus. I think it might be able to, but Somnus out of mana. As a magic one still, Chaka will miss, Somnus survives, old 11 in the back lane, getting a kill against Innocence. Very nice job here with the spear, and FY sniping for Silar. FY still surviving, FY is getting away! Right in front of these two beefy heroes, another snipe! Bringing down Sin Q, Faith Beyond, you're the only one left alive, and they're chasing after you. They got the spear, and they should have the damage. FY wanted that kill as well, but his team takes it from under his nose. That seems appropriate, TA is going to join in here. Chalice a target, Chakra, I'm okay, Chalice. Wukong's command, and look at those TPs! Five TPs immediately, you're not getting away from your Faith Beyond. That is the Power Rangers coming in in full force, making sure Ehome cannot fight them a single time. And Ehome tries to match him to some degree. They have three heroes here, T Terrible is still farming mid, and Samus could be the target. Good job, they kill Samus immediately. Arena Blood has been used here, can PSGLGD still win this? Old Eleven is suffering a lot of damage from the Mortimer's Kisses. He barely survives, the Koki guarantees the kill, nothing to say, quite aggressive. But Chao is still here, they get the double stun with the Fire Blast, and nothing to say, you're here alone. The Inkswell will trigger, the FY snipe as well, and they finish him off with a little jump from the Monkey King. Chalice ensures that this TA dies. That was a pretty good initiation though by Ehome. You still took away two cores just thanks to Mortimer's Kisses.
This could be a target. This is not a bad target where they find them. It's just a so, uh, just an off laner, right? But it's a start. All right, the cookie. They got into the arena, and the snowball helps. Nothing to say. We'll get the skill. Honestly, Nice TP come here from LGD once again. Oh yeah, yeah. They want to fight this. Why? Why? Run away, Mortimer. Keep going. Keep on oh, running. The fusel's ready on Chalice. So why? I think you're done for. 576 damage with that crit. So I think that's kind of a win for Eho. Uh, until Faith Beyond. Oh, You're just a big creep. Him. You're just a big pinata. Look how much Chalice enjoys hitting you. It's like, yeah, uh, guys. I'm Uden. Actually, that's, that's too much hate. The poor guy just had a really bad lane. There's not much he can do. Old 11, though, he's going to be the answer, and this is pretty good. Because while Faith Beyond is not worth anything in the net worth chart, Old 11 is actually worth a fair amount, but he tanks the whole thing. Old 11 is teaching you what a real offlaner looks like. The Roman war of the Roman god of war is not gonna die so easily. Finally dying to Mortimer's case. Has two ultimates wasted. Siler had to go in really far and will be punished for it. And Y is fighting a 1v1 against FY. And it seems like the extra letter is giving him the advantage. Sinkyu cared some space as he goes down to PSG LGD. He's ready with the mass TP. It's so hard to find openings. Oh, they missed that Kofi, unfortunately, but they will tear through Sinkyu. Oh. I blinked and the ogre ceased to exist, and I think the ice shards. No, they did not give vision of Somnus. Had, they had to guess whether he went top or bottom. 50 50 chance, and lucky lucky for Ehome that yeah. they were not able to guess it right. Well, Faith Beyond felt bad for Ehome, so he's like, nah, guys, here here you go. Here's a kill for you. Once your again, Faith Beyond is giving yeah. gift. But wait, right. actually, this might oh. be a mistake by Chalice. He's get disintegrated. Oh no, this monkey is gonna be a king no more. Enemy carry takes you, you're done. Okay, Snowball for Somnus, they have Mortimer's Kisses. He managed to bring this back, Somnus is down. Old 11, the Arena Blood won't do much, but the Inkswell might just stun the TA. Oh, they stop her in the middle of the jump, but nothing to say, we'll keep on fighting. The Fire Blast, everything to bring down this TA, but they just can't. Nothing to say, gets away, and X Nova will suffer for his sins. Max, they can't take a rush right now. TB's not even near them. I don't know if they want to fight this. Timbersaw's been caught out in the back lines. Faith Beyond, Essence Ring, he can't get away. But the Mortimer's Kisses are giving him some space. The Blade Mills as well. TA walks in, hoping to get the Mars, but instead she gets stunned out. DKB's been committed. Y is dead in the back line, so is Faith Beyond. Nothing to say, just wants to get the kill onto Old 11. Can he manage? Terrorblade, meanwhile, is fighting the rest of the team. And he outruns the Wukong's command. Sinkyu does go down. Nobody's died from LGD just yet, but nothing to say, has something to say about that. As he kills off Somnus. So that's at least a mid laner. Ogre Magi also joins him. Why dying in the back lines? Because Chalice just finds a quick kill. And they're going to chase further. They know where they are. Old 11. No, the Spear Ooh, Mars connects. What a, what a beautiful spear. Sinkyu is to fight back, but they're controlling the TA. The ghost is going to kill her. FY ensures she goes down. And now it's Terrible versus the world. Snowball joins in. But is that going to be too late? It is. Siler's already gone. And Sinkyu just joined his friend in the grave. Oh, old 11, what a player! Yes, old 11. This Wukong's command, you can just fear him out of the, of oh, the ring. Somnus, okay. I think Y is done for. Ooh, Faith Beyond, Oops. that's a Timber Shane, that's not a hook shot. I don't know what you're trying to hook there. There's <laughs> uh, a blade mail, at least to give him some space. Oh, okay, they already waste the Ghost Scepter. Sink you, why are you in alone? Okay, never mind, you're not alone. Seller joins in. As soon as Seller joins in, the power point starts. But wait, FY can still go down. He's the first victim. Of the Chinese servers, E Home following further. X Nova, can we get the next slide, please? X Nova, I don't know if they're going for him. It seems like it. They're chasing after him. Has Faith Beyond tries to get the kill. The buyback comes back, and they're gonna actually manage to kill off Faith Beyond. He's been controlled. Goodbye, Faith Beyond. Ooh. Here's the Wukong's command, but it gets cancelled by the Terror Blade, and they've managed to murder the Monkey King in the middle of his Wukong's command. E Home is not afraid of lag. Kale is not a word in the dictionary for them. Eternal Envy, but I would agree that he's very aggressive as well. Look at that play, old 11. He's not afraid of this. They use all the minigunner on him. Faith Beyond, just trying to, you know, he's hoping that they concentrate on him, but they're done concentrating on Faith Beyond. They just want the towers. In goes Chalice, there's a Wukong's command already. There's a Wukong's command already. Yeah. Honestly, I think this kind of play style really benefits the LGD right now. They, are, they have two players, two cores, they are really selfless. Four, okay, 11, jumping in constantly for the repositioning spears. 
Oh, Summers is done. That's his ages. Snowball comes in, old 11, hoping to finish off the TA. Getting, oh, the cookie saves her! And she's away, they used the Grimstork ultimate on her already. Even with the Heaven's Ready? Halberd. They're actually you losing their Grimstork them. ultimate entirely. No more Soulbind for you, nothing to say wants to go further. Ah, uh, but the combination, Arena Blood from Wukong's Command is cancelled by the Terrorize from this Terror Blade! And the fear stops the Wukong's Command! The Monkey has been blown to smithereens! Old 11 is tanking all the damage in the world! They can't finish off this Mars! The Roman God of War what is has managed to take this whole team fight. He is surviving. He's killing Silent, but no, Silent is asunder. Old Eleven is gone, and the Sunder will cancel Ex Nova and Somnus. The E Home just managed to turn this around with a ridiculous sun Sunder. As long as E Home play this safe and don't troll and not make any major mistake, they'll be able to come back. Oh no, Old Eleven, why are you here alone? You've been playing so well until now. Bulwark used. Is he trying to create space for his team? Is his team trying to come back? Actually, is this just a bait by Old Eleven? They use the ultimate for now. Old Eleven is not going to be killed here, but Ehome is committing to this regardless. LG doesn't want to help him fight, and now Ex Nova, you're in trouble. They use Mortimer's Kisses. Both supports are now going to be melted literally by the Kisses, and that's Ex Nova gone. But from the back line, Sumnus comes in, hoping to get a kill. The Tusk survives this. Nice little snowball there by SynQ. But look at this Chalice, though. This yeah, little monkey. They know. Old Eleven has been doing this shenanigans all game. And now, Old Eleven, you're going to pay for your sin, son. Look at this. Everyone is just pummeling Paul Old Eleven in the back lines, though. They're having their own little fight as Leshrac finds Sin Q. Sin Q controls Lesh. Nothing to say. Use the BKB. They want to kill Somnus. A bit of slow thanks to the traps. Is that going to be enough damage? Nothing to say. Last hit. Is he going to get it? He gets stunned last second. The Ink Soul saves him. And nothing to say will be brought down. And TA was alone so far. Oh no, oh, the arena blood! Old oh, Eleven just did it again! Can he really kill this Terror Blade in time? There's a Sunder ready! Oh, Siler gets it away! A second time! It's the second time this happens for Siler! And he's gonna be fine! He has monster style, he can run away, they're giving him enough space! He even kills the Ogre in the process! Old oh, Eleven, you just lost half your stats! And with a snowball, you're gonna lose your life as well! Into the stratosphere you go! E home! They don't seem scared of LGD anymore. In fact, they're the aggressors now oh, as they maybe. finish up FY. Okay, Somnus in the middle of five. You're really cocky. You're really confident. Is that going to amount to your death? It seems so. Bright is a capital sin, Somnus. Learn your lesson. Yeah, you also have to communicate on your side. You have yes. to You have to tell your teammates that, all right, guys, we are focused firing this TV. We, we cannot afford to let him pull off his thunder. Otherwise, all the effort, all the spells we use, oh. Going to waste. If you snag him during Metamorphosis as well, it's really great. Sync Q on point with that blink. Uh, he had to use that second extra. Okay, the silence. Nothing to say. Maybe a bit cocky. Stuns the Aegis. Might just lose the Aegis immediately. Goodbye, Aegis. But what an arena of blood. They forced the terror, the terror away from Siler. And nothing to say. Comes back. Terror Wave gives him some space. And now they're able to just destroy Chalice. As Old Eleven is trying to tank everything for his team, nothing to say. Doesn't care about Old Eleven, he's going straight for Somnus. He goes straight for the damage. They want to kill this Disco Gold. Do they have the damage for it? It seems like they do. Faith Beyond, back from the dead, seems like he's ready to pummel Somnus into submission. Old Eleven is the third time. Yes, you survive, fantastic, but you can't tank everything for your team. Ehome is learning GG. to ignore them. All right? Okay. That was fantastic, actually. Really well played by Ehome. Well deserved victory. Yeah, well deserved, man. They are playing with a lot of patience. And I think Eleven, he's the heroes that he's, he's the one player that can just win you games or lose you the games. 